Stop sniffing your farts. <laughs> Red mode. just finished the character creation of Chairman Mao. All praise Mao. But I need to go back and I need to add a companion. Edit. <laughs> Shut up. The only companion we can add to Chairman Mao is his Dingle Fart assistant called Dingle Fart. Right now, Dingle Fart speaks like that and he also uh, <laughs> minces around the house yes right now what what kind of character should dingle fart be he's gonna be the servant of chairman Mao. Right, how do i randomize him no fairies <laughs> right i like it he's a bit dweeby he's got a non-confident body posture that's what he needs, he needs to be Ooh. Perfect. Um, all right, let's do his personality first. We'll give us some ideas. So, living with a tyrant, he needs to have a werewolf. No, he needs... What, what is his aspirations? Food, creativity, athletic, animal, deviance, business. Can I build a family with a tyrant inside? I think I can. Let's make him hipster. Why not? I live in East London. So we got lots of hipsters. Hipsters usually consist of white people dressing up as everyone else's culture. <laughs> so um, let's do it. Now hipsters tend to have big beards. Now not all hipsters have beards. Especially I like this guy. I like his orange glow. Gives him a sign of health. All that soy lattes. Yes. <laughs> I like it. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. There it is. Alright, I like this. This is perfect. I'm not going to spend too much time on this. Maybe I'm, I might go back. I might make him a creative, actually, now thinking about it. Quite possibly a cat lover, dog lover. Yes. Look at that. Love it. What else would this man be? That could work, but I also want him to be a bit of an art lover. A bit of a geek. A bit of an art lover. A bit of a geek. A bit of a geek. We're on to something now. Come on, Dinglefart. How will you and Chairman Mao get on? Where does our story begin? In the spring. <laughs> right. Uh, now, where do we live? Yes. Let's go with this one. Excellent. We can just buy... What's what we've got here? We've got... Do we have anything here? We could buy a little shack to live in. We shall start off in separate bedrooms, <laughs> as it should be. Um, okay, we go. Now, I'm not a whiz at this game. I've only played it a few times, but I'm sure it follows the same trends as the other ones. Right. Well, I'm not controlling Chairman Mao. He can just do what he likes. So, I'm going to have to build a life around... Where's your hipster clothes gone? Yes, that's right. That's right. So we're going to build a life for Dinglefart. Oh, don't speak to him. He knows where you live. <laughs> right, you're an artist. What can you do as an artist? Vote on neighbourhood action plans. Absolutely, just moved in. He's bored already. He's just moved into his new house. Oh, okay. You can vote on stuff. I remember the good old days. We used to play board games and read books. Nowadays, the only one can think about is their phone and their TV. They're juicing it up, chugging all the wretched, uh, chugging all the wretched juice. Um. Okay, well. Oh, free love. That's got to be done. <laughs> Not even gonna read it. Not having a pillow fight when Mouse is done. 
Well, this is nice. Let's have a look what we got in here. Table for four. Nice bath and shower. Way up! Get a job, you bum. Detective, doctor, scientist, actor. Ooh. Conservationist. Yes, why not? Wildlife enthusiast. Critic. There's lots of them, Gardner. Oh, let's be a Gardner. Gonna go to work? Dingle fart should jump start and accept this assignment. <laughs> oh my god, they're becoming friends. Let's hide behind the wall. What's Plopsy? <laughs> Quick, he's coming back in. Escape. Yes! How do I get more than one? That's right. That's what every hipster can't live without. <laughs> Not there! There! He's coming, he's staring at you. Don't look at him. Oh my god, he's coming. This will make a grave. This will make a perfect child sized grave. He's actually being very nice. Purchase seeds. Oh, that's how you purchase seeds. Catnip. Starter flowers. Fruit snaps. Whatever. Look at me. Crushing this garden. Oh! Friendly introduction. Stop planting. We have a visitor. Dingle. <laughs> that's right. Woo her with your charm. You're that bitch I saw on the computer. <laughs> no flies this time. Only fans is overrated. What's up your face? Mouse coming. Don't be rude. Right, finish off your gardening. Let, let Chairman Mao deal with her. Bye. Yeah, I don't like you either. You can't invite her in, you know. Ask about werewolf packs. Yeah, why not? Oh, you're back. But no one likes a dead silence. Talk about fishing sods. Dinglefart has identified the minnow. The minnow. As a type of fish. Don't look him in the eyes. Buy some seeds. <laughs> so to crowing. Garlic over here. And garlic over there. <laughs> it's like how my cat looks at me. Right, I'm gonna cook some dinner. Cook a grand meal. Hand it. Mexican standoff. He's coming. Oh my goodness, he's actually being useful. I've misjudged this character. History has misjudged Chairman Mao. Very indeed. Our first dinner living together. Isn't this nice? It certainly is. Dingle is flourishing as much as his crop of germinating plant friends. Is this budding emotion a sign that he likes gardening? He does like gardening. Every little one a grave. You can plant all this. And then go to bed. Then have a pillow fight with Chairman Mao. <laughs> Stop sniffing your farts. <laughs> this is strangely upsetting and comically brilliant. We shall not talk about this. Oh, I don't have work today. Oh, and my plants are growing. Plant more things. Plant more things. Wait, they're mine. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh-oh. Now it's all happening. Yes, prank the toilet. Oh. 
Why? <laughs> <laughs> Rainbows. Oh, Green Gardening received the most votes. I don't want to go anywhere with you, Selena Lopez. Off he goes to work. Brilliant. Things are going well so far. They seem to be getting along. I've got a job. Look at them. They're getting on that peas and carrots. What's up with his eyes? I mean, <laughs> he was looking weird. Look. Aww. Oh. <laughs> Mother. You just don't get it, do you? <laughs> I'll leave Mao alone. Maybe I can speak to the locals. Oh my goodness, look at me, I'm a baller. Sniffing those tomatoes. Oh my goodness. Don't give Mao any ideas. Oh, cooking is delectable. Flip those flapjacks, toss that sauce. Dingle. <laughs> Dingle is in his element. Oh, my character's called Dingle, I forgot about that. Uh, does does he want to gobble up this opportunity to embrace how he likes cooking? Yes! Doesn't like you. Just pissing over your cooking. Uh oh! <laughs> Ever been fired out of a cannon? Look, I've made your food, you miserable bastard. going on here? <laughs> First impressions. Right, eat chips and salsa. He's gonna eat your food. What the hell's going on over here? What is he? Or she? NAP inspector. I feel bad that I haven't made Chairman Mao some food for dinner. I'm afraid this household is not compliant with the following neighborhood action plans. Green gardening. What the fuck do you call this? Oh, I've met a friend. Well, i got to go to bed, bitch. i got work in the morning. Here comes trouble. No, she's going anyway. Oh, she's off skydiving. <laughs> Simpleton. Hello. God, she's annoying. Oh, someone needs tingles. It's okay, I won't watch. Alright, let's cook for... Let's offer a peace treaty. Uh, make it... Make sack lunch? <laughs> she has a sandwich. How do you make lunch for her? Yes. Perfect. Mal doesn't have a job. Mal doesn't need a job. He's off to play with the wolves. What's that? Oh, let's travel to Peak. Off we go. The confident stride. We're traveling into a mine. Oh. Oh. Oh, it just means... Wolfgang Wilder. They've left. They don't like you. Dingle decided to enter the competition. He decided that entry to the, uh, will be the largest apple crown. Sadly, the sheer size of the apple calls the tree to snap in half and playing at 100 feet in the air. The apple came crashing down outside the contest ground with a spot of the sand is qualified for the contest and the sign to clean up the large apple sauce for the Fun 8, Dingle Fun. Well, we should have him. It's Grizzly Adams. 
Come and join me. <laughs> it spooked him. Look at him, loves it. His reactions changed almost instantly. <laughs> Plotting death. No, no, no. <laughs> so what are you, a hippie? Goes charging this one up. That's right. Such a weird collection of people. 